That's Grima. That's the demon who destroyed my world. And now he is among us. The terrible size of it. Gods! For once the legend spoke true. We can't face him. Not in a straight battle. He'd kill us all. Still, If only we still had the fire emblem. We could ask Naga for power. Then at least we'd have a chance. But Validar took the emblem. And it was lost inside the dragon's table. I know. Hey. What? You mean this fire emblem? <laughs> the emblem? But how? <laughs> I stole it from you once, remember? The least I could do is steal it back. <laughs> Robin, you sly cat. You never cease to amaze. Quickly now, we must complete the awakening before Grima catches on. It's said the first exalt paid tribute to Naga at the site of Mount Prism. Really? Do you know where exactly? Of course. There is an altar at the peak of the mountain. If my lord would perform the awakening, it must be done there. Hmm. A small hope is better than no hope at all. Hurry, everyone! Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we do- Oh, you can buy Dragon Soul Plus and Beast Soul Plus? How do I not remember this? I carry only the finest. Yeah, you do. Well, gonna buy one of those right away. And one of those. Uh, yeah, we were in a video or something. Last time on Fire Emblem Awakening, we defeated- Validar at the dragon's table, preventing him from reawakening Grima. But it turns out that a different Robin from a corrupted future followed Lucina when she traveled to the past in order to make sure that Grima reawoken despite our efforts. Well, now he's here, and despite all the fate that we have changed, we still have an impossible battle that we need to overcome. Let's see what we can do. First off, we got a Lucina and Tiki conversation. Um, Tiki, how does the day find you? Yes. Perfectly well, Lucina. Why do you ask? <sighs> I just wanted to say, if there's anything I can help you with, please let me know. Thank you. Very kind of you, but I'm fine for the moment. No, wait. Uh, of course, sorry to disturb you. It's just, well, if you ever need help, I want to be there first. I'm very grateful for your concern, Lucina. Truly, I am. But remember that you are an important part of this army. Your first duty must be to your fellow soldiers. Especially as you once dated take... As you once dared take down the great name of Marth as your own. That was perhaps rash of me. You knew him, didn't you? The great King Marth. What was he like? Listen. Did not investigate this before you took his name? Yes. Only the legends. I called myself Marth to feel closer to him. I've always yearned to know what he was really like, the man behind the deeds. I see. Your enthusiasm seems sincere enough. Very well, I will tell you about him. But not today. Perhaps the next time we meet. You have my gratitude. Oh, thank you, Tiki. I would hear all that there is to tell. Oh, now I want to complete that one before the end of the game, but we're running out of chapters here! But, at least we get to the end of Olivia and Payne's story. Let's check it out. You. Do you remember our talk about learning how to be strong? Yes. Oh, of course. Actually, I've been wondering when we could start my lessons. Right. I've thought deeply on the problem, and I may have an answer. But it is the answer of a Togwell. It may not suit you. I'm willing to try anything. Well... I began thinking about what sets humans and Togwell apart. The difference is that humans are fundamentally irrational creatures. Um... Irrational? Yes. You humans always attempt the impossible while ignoring the possible. This is, as I said, irrational. It is not, however, a failing. Krom, for example, chases an impossible task, and yet it is a noble cause. 
I think this is one of the greatest strengths of your species. So, wait. So should I... So I should be more irrational? Good question. Yes. Oh. Okay. <sighs> it's actually quite rational for you to be irrational, I mean. Huh? Okay, stop it. Hmm. Listen, Olivia. Can you tell me what is possible or impossible? I speak here of the future. Uh, well... <sighs> you see, you do not know. None of us, human or Togwell, know this. But you decide that nothing is possible and give up trying to achieve anything. <sighs> this is your first assignment. You must learn your own limits. You need to discover what it is you're capable of. Well... Okay. I've got it. Learn my limits. Discover my capabilities. Be strong. The only way to know your limits is to push yourself to them. At least, that is what a Togwell would do. It won't be easy, but if you apply yourself... I appreciate it. Oh, I will. I'm going to apply myself the, like terracle on bread. Or treacle. What the fruit is that? Just you wait. Thank you so much for your advice, Pain. Maybe we could talk again sometime. Yes. I would be glad to. We're in this together now. Okay. I just know... I just knowing you're a part of this makes me feel like I could do anything. <gasps> Irrational creatures indeed. I ship it, but wait, she's already married, so... Threesome, perhaps? Long Koo? Why do you have, like, such good... Long Koo and Pain are such great characters. They get have such great communications with everyone. And now time for another great communication with another great character, Lanku and Tharja. Tonight we're holding a war council. Don't be late. Pretty much. Is Lissa hosting again? Maybe she'll make more of those little honey cakes. Oh, hold on. You got a bug stuck in your hair. Come back. Don't come any closer. What? Well, if I repulse you that much. No. You are not special. I feel the same way about all women. Well, that makes it all better. Hmm, I wonder if someone cast a curse to make you fear women. Right. I think not. What? Then why are you so afraid of us? Women. Something at the core of my nature has always made me uneasy around you. <laughs> yeah, still sounds like a curse to me. I wonder who cast it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You want me to fix it? What? Much. It must be hard, turning into a gibbering idiot whenever you meet a woman. <laughs> you have the power to rid me of this fear? <laughs> Someone's interested. No, I'm not. What? Sure, whatever. When you change your mind, you know where to find me. Like, they're all good, but they're also all kind of contradictory because pain and... Cherish sort of resolve Long Ku's uh, fear of women, but then when we go to Tharja, he still has it. Maybe she'll be the one to quell his fear for good. Only one way to find out. Now, let's go through the inventory and give everyone their new items. First off, make sure that Pain and Noe have only the best of the best when it comes to their stones. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't know that that was Tiki's line when you went shopping. Ah, oh, shopping, finally, a concept older than I am. <laughs> That's sinking hilarious. Okay, I've got everything set up, and we're ready to go. It's time to begin chapter 24. It's the name of the game! That means it must be important! It's beautiful. <sighs> the divine dragon power flows through the, every blade of grass here. Really? Wait, something doesn't feel right. <clears throat> we must prepare for battle. Grima has sent servants here. I can sense it. They'll be on us soon. So, in the last episode, we also got Basilo and Flavia to join us. They were immediate mainstays on my team as soon as I got them originally. Because I've wanted them to join us for such a long time. 
But now... We can't have them, unfortunately, because that make our team too big. That stinks. And there isn't anyone in particular that I'd want to get rid of. In terms of communications, I'm pretty sure... Uh, both Bastila and Flavia, they can only communicate with Robin and each other, so... Uh, that's kind of unfortunate. I would like to show him off in battle, though, so let's see if I could switch him out for someone. Uh, might be a good idea to switch out people who are level 20, so Olivia. Not to mention, I just finished her thing with Pain, so I think we're safe to actually switch her out if we want to. Who else has gotten maxed out Robin, but we're not getting rid of her? Wow, Olivia, you're just the ultimate warrior, I guess. So we're going to say bye to you for a bit. The other one is going to be... Uh, I think Anna, but I, I like getting her level ups because she kind of needs them. Uh... Sumia also kind of needs the level ups, but I know she's always getting taken down. Oh, let's... Oh, okay, how about this? Is there any treasure chests? If so... Oh, this is a beautiful background. Backdrop area for us to be fighting on. I like the location. Are they all risen? Yeah, they're risen enemies. That's good to keep in mind, I guess. Oh, you drop a Thoron. Good to know. Hmm. Uh, you're so stinking close with Tharja getting fully leveled up. I'm tempted to choose her just because she's so close and like she's a crazy powerhouse, so like we don't really need her. with the long coup conversation though so why would I want to get rid of her sorry Anna okay we're a bit spread out so it would be wise to make sure everyone's where I want them to be uh, you two only talk with each other so I'll keep you close together uh, I'm still working with Trying to get Robin and Lucina maxed out, so it's good that they're right there with each other. Um, Long Cougar right here with uh, Tharja. Krom is right here. Who do I want to pair Krom up with at this point? Does Tiki speak with Krom at all? I don't think she does. Uh, no, she does not. Hmm. Got Noe and Tiki here. Krom, Lanku. Huh. I guess that'll do. Let's go for it. How could Risen infiltrate this sacred place? Their power must be linked to Grima's. We must destroy them. Route the enemy. Time to go all out with my new beast and uh, dragon stones. Is it called dragon stone? Yeah, dragon stones. Like, is it mana candy stone? No, it isn't. Uh, so let's have the two of them team up. That seems like a cool combination. Uh, we got 26 or 0. G. I I wonder who I should go with. Booty up, and dragon up. Look at the singing power combo. So singing happy that we could buy multiple uh, ones of those. Level up. She's very close to maxing out. And let's go with Basilo and Flavia. They're going to be really fun to use. So Flavia is a sword user with... Uh, oh, we could have changed their their classes at, right now if we wanted to because they come, with us, come to us at level 10. 
Uh, probably not super necessary, but I'll keep it in mind. Maybe I'll do it in the next episode. Uh, she is a sword user who could also use axes. And then Vasilo is an axe user who could also use bows. So I gave him a lot of our cool looking bows that we haven't been able to use. Uh, maybe we'll get to use them right here. Uh, they were very slow though, unfortunately. Maybe just because we're in the grass or in the woods rather. Uh, let's just head on over here, I guess. Uh, next we got Tiki and Seiri, probably. Uh, let's... Uh, who's got the better range? Uh, Tiki does, so we're gonna go over here. Uh, we'll have Robin with Lucina. Krom with... Uh, Sumia. Wait. Listen, Krom aren't maxed out? Yeah, I thought they were. I thought I got them maxed out already. Rank B? Okay. I apologize if a lot of you have been shouting at me for a long time, but, like, I seriously thought they were maxed out already. Well, that's good to know before the LP ends. Okay, pair them up. And so I guess I'll just have to get Krom and listen to a bunch of battles just so I could get that uh, topped off. Uh, and we'll put you with Sumia and then Cherish here on your own, I guess. Okay, I can't believe I went this whole time without knowing that. I thought I maxed it out. Uh, let's see. Tiki or Seiri? We'll go with Tiki, because she's got a new dragon stone that she wants to try out. Uh, Lucino, Krom, could you... Oh, I know Krom's out of commission for this turn. I'm going to hold off on having chairs fight people just because she's alone. She won't benefit from any uh, communication stuff, and that's what I'm really striving for, right? The final stretch of our adventure. Uh, we could have that, or we could have that. Gee, I wonder. Go and do that. And that. Very, very nice. And, oh, I forgot about that. Robin is maxed out in stats, so I should have Lucy now in the front. To, just so she gets the majority of the experience. Okay, good to know. Uh, assuming we need a... Someone who could break down some armor. Or we could just stay away from them. That's always nice, too. Uh, Beast Killer is the best, so we'll go with this one. Uh, okay, thank you, Sumia. I appreciate it, but... Oh, 69! Okay, I'm fine with that. Uh, go right here, I guess? So that's the only one we could reach, and okay. As usual, Tharja could kill him in one hit, so we're good. And she's loving every second of it. As am I! Very, very close to maxing her out. As if she really needs it. Uh, I guess I'll just put Cherish right here. Enemy phase, let's go! Thank you, I appreciate it. That's a lot of damage to Frederick. Do not like, do not like. Oh, they're all going for him. No, I don't want you to. Frederick doesn't deserve this. Remember when he was like the ultimate warrior at the beginning of the game? What happened to that? I don't know what weapon to give him. Like, that would just magically make him amazing. Uh, maybe I should start forging his stuff. Yeah, like right at the end, I'll start forging. Oh boy. It'll be a miracle if you survive this. Thank you, miracles! Thank you for KOing him. I did get that experience, so at least you get something out of this battle. Level 16. Uh, let's see what we got. Elixir. Very nice, but don't want it right now. Tiki. Let's see what you got. It's only 25% on the enemy's chance. They got their Balagna, as I read it. Uh, very good. Nothing to worry about now that we have unlimited dragon and beast stone pluses. Just feel a little bit stronger, really, Tiki. Uh, they keep on running over here. As is the case with Risen, they they all need to be defeated. You can't just get rid of the leader because they're monsters and they'll keep fighting no matter what. Uh, we I really messed up on around here. Just wait for me, fellas. Um. 
Distant allies HP. Frederick, definitely. Go and do that. Uh, we'll have Tiki. Is anyone down here? There's a couple of people down here. Let's go ahead and see uh, Flavia and Basilo finally in battle. Uh, none of these will KO. Let's switch to him. None of those will KO. Uh, let's go for that one. Let's see what he could do. Yeah, these two are really huge stinking powerhouses right at the end of the game. So if the final stretch is really difficult for you, uh, have no fear because Flavia and Basilo are here. Uh, that was really lame, but whatever. I'm just going to have you guys keep on going forward. Uh, all these trees are like very limiting to our movement, but we'll just keep on pushing through. Uh, do not have Robin in the front. Switch to Lucina. Have her take him out. He's got a spear. It's not a samurai spear. Yes, you do. Hooray. Uh, we got that. We don't really want it right now. Let's see. Just you two. Uh, you could possibly get rid of him. Who are you teamed up? You're teamed with Sumia. Uh, there's an archer here. If there's an archer, I should get rid of them because Cherish. Or Cherish could just do it herself? Yes, she can. Let me stand right here just so you can get benefits from Frederick and Sumia. Okay, very nice. And then, let's see. No more, no more bows, right? I'm sick and tired of you archers just coming in here and getting rid of all my flying units. Uh, with the benefit from them as well. Hopefully this could work. Come on, Samia, just jump in real quick. Come on. Unfortunately not. Great. 10 HP for Frederick. This isn't good. Oh, healing HP is also not good. Frederick's going down. Oh, unless you wanted to keep on defending Sumia, I'd appreciate it. Unfortunately, I didn't say the line. Still have hope, though. Jeez, okay. Just keep on doing those jabs. And what she did on this enemy who had one HP left. Because then we wouldn't have to deal with this nonsense. Okay, but at least we got rid of it anyway. 69! We got a 69 out of it. Sumia predicted the 69. I'm just gonna, that's going to be my head cannon. She knew it would happen, so that's why she uh, held herself back from finishing off the enemy. A challenge. And now 99. Great. Taunting me. Oh, jeez. Uh, thank you for constantly dodging. Uh, all these enemies are lame. Oh, 1 HP. It always has to be 1 HP. At least he gets a level up again. Uh, I must admit, I'm outdone myself. Okay, cool. Good for you, buddy. Well, two level ups for you is really sinking good, so I won't be too heartbroken about this. It's really unfortunate, though. You're being the MVP of this match. Until that happened. Did not mean to go in the first person. Jesus. Okay, they're going for Flavia. Uh, depending on what axe she has equipped would have determined whether or not she could have counterattacked like that. Oh, they're going to keep on popping up. Oh, jeez. Uh... I wish they could reach it already. I'm gonna reach some enemies. Uh, switch. Do you got any throwing swords, Krom? No, you don't. Uh, we will continue to push forward, I guess. Uh, let's have Basilo fight someone now with his silver axe. That wasn't even a critical. It did like over stinking 70 damage or something like that. Uh, let's go. I want to get the sparkly, but yeah, well, whatever. It'll save time in the long run. Okay, at least you get some experience in it. And I do mean some. So hopefully not fall off the edge of glory. Mm, don't mind if I do. A seed of trust. Oh, that might be good. Build support between two paired units, so that'll be very good for uh, ranking or maxing out these last few communication sessions I want to do. Uh, who do we got? We got a lot of people left. 
Uh, still working our way through the woods. Uh, have you there? Have you there? We will... Huh. Sumia... Sumia and Cherish are on their own, so I could pair them up. I guess... Lance, Lance, Lance. I'm gonna leave them here just so Krom has someone to fight, and I'll go over here instead. Get rid of this guy. Uh, I guess it's with Cherish, as always. Thank you for having like a bajillion singing hits with that thing. And time for the enemy phase. Thank you for going after Krom and Lissa. Uh, we have the advantage, it seems, so I don't know why you did that. Thank you for being an awesome pair of siblings. Yay, they're continuously going for Lissa. They think she's weak. They ain't seen nothing yet. This is probably what the crowd that saw her at the beginning of the game when she was just a healer. Now she's a stinking warrior of death and destruction. Who makes nice lemon pies and broke her hammer? Oh no! And unfortunately gets her. I wish you could just switch to his bow on command, but unfortunately not. That's not how it works. Thank you for dodging. Thank you for taking him down. Look at me go. She got renewal, a new skill. We'll have to check and see what that does. You know, Robin's gonna take out this guy. Thank you for dodging, and thank you for following up, Lucina. Thanks. We got a couple more fights. Uh, I think we're like only there's one, two, only two more in the boss. That's kind of amazing. We went through this lot quicker than I thought we would. Jeez, that was a lot of misses. At least we got a level up out of it, but I wasn't expecting that. Okay, well, yeah. Okay, geez, you proved your point. Uh, we'll have Krom wants to take this guy down if we can. He is an axe user. Krom, that's good to know. Let's get rid of him. Thank you for defending. And down he goes. Ninety-nine. I really hope they get maxed out at the end of this battle. I completely forgot. I didn't even know if they had that. Uh, let's see. What should I do now? Uh, Paint is with Noe, so I could attack them from afar. Thank you for actually being able to take them out in one hit. Let's-a go! And all on your own, Noe. Good job. And I'm just like, it's insane how like a complete 180 I did with like this LP was like, again, it's not that I wasn't having fun with it, it's just like, the recording took a lot longer just because I wasn't really feeling like, I was just dreading like the, uh, voice destruction part of it, I guess. But now that, like I found a solution to that, like my voice just felt great this whole time and I'm enjoying like the final stretch of the game, so I'm completely okay with just recording this LP all the way to the end, hopefully I can get it done today. That would be really cool, but it would take many more hours. So let's see what we could do. Uh, Tiki, you're with Seiri. Uh, Tharja, you're not at your level up yet, but you can't even reach anyone, so it doesn't matter. Uh, I guess we'll have Tiki take care of this guy. So there's one HP, just because Cherish is like, going on a wild ride and couldn't hit him. We go and then we'll have Cherish and Sumi pick up that treasure over here. We got a superior bow, good to know. I mean, for that to rhyme, uh, you could go over here and then Krom, not Krom, Robin and Lucina go down here, switch to Lucina so she gets the experience, or they could just go that way. 
Uh, Krom won't be able to counterattack. Oh, geez, it's kind of a lot of damage. Over chair snow. Stand tall. There are a lot of singing reinforcements that are definitely halting our progress, right? When we thought we were going to wrap things up quickly. Things got turned around a bit, but I don't mind the extra experience and, um, the experience and, uh, bond growing maneuvers, I guess. Jesus Christ, seriously? Maybe we do just need to get rid of the boss. I don't know. Well, he can only attack physically, um, like right in front of us, so I'll for him instead. Uh, just, oh wait, no, the falchion. I was like, wait, the regular falchion? Uh, yes, let's go for it. If he could heal as well, that'd be great. Um, oh, oh no, 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 no. I know how this plays out. Um, God darn it, why is Lissa our only healer? Hmm. Uh. Oh, I'm gonna have to finagle this. Let's see, can I transfer. Who would be transferring Lissa? I can't get Krom to safety. God darn it. I definitely need to just get rid of this enemy, though. That was really unfortunate. I was hoping he would heal. Level up. That's good, but I really don't want to have to redo this. That'd be so stinking annoying. Um, I'm just going to move him over here. Maybe he'll go for Tharja just because she can't counterattack if he's up close to her. Oh, God. I really don't like this. Uh, Flavia, you could keep on murdering everyone. I'm very much okay with that. Only 6% chance, though. Uh oh. Uh, doesn't seem to be a problem, though. Very good. Get that experience. Level up. Huh. Guess we'll bring Noe here. Okay, we'll go with Pain. This is kind of what it sounds like. I, oh my god, just always worry way too sick and much when Krom is in danger. And for good reason, because if he dies, it's game over. Oh, why does this have to happen like this? Uh, you two are the only ones left. Uh, we'll have... Robin and Lucina attack this guy. We can do it. Uh, can you transfer that HP recovery over to uh, Krom by any chance? No? Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna attempt to give him more. Oh, wait. Chairs? Chairs can do a ranged attack. I did not know. And so she's a mage, god darn it. Maybe she can. I'm going to switch her thing to fire. And chairs, can you save the sinking day? Let's find out. Uh, not quite. Don't go for Krom. 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 Also, they're going to attack us. Okay, sure. Uh, is Lucina going to take him down? Thank you for dodging. Okay, no, he couldn't, she couldn't even counterattack. Thank you! He took the bait! Thank you for missing. And down he goes. Very close to a level up. At least Krom survived. That's all that really matters. Dodge that. Uh, what do we got? Keep on dodging. Still more, and more, and more, and more! Jesus Christ, so many enemies. Uh, do not want him to die. Oh, god darn it. Switch to... Her. No. Uh, I guess we'll attack with this and have Krom finish him off. Either Krom or Lissa. 
Uh, there you go. There you go, thank you. For once, I'm actually glad that Sumia did no damage. And Cherish got a level up in the process, and that's good. We're working together to get everyone's friendship stats all maxed out. Switch to Lissa, because I'm stinking panicking. Iron Axe, let's go. It's all right. Oh, yeah! Three whole damage. Uh, I don't know. Let's see if we could get pain fully maxed out with uh, level ups. That'd be really cool. Uh, we got defense and more Togwell booty. It was your time. Yes, pain is fully maxed out. That's really cool. A lot of good stats right at the end there. And Tharja, you're up next. Do you have anyone you could go after? Not quite, but I'm sure you'll find something to keep you occupied. Uh, Tiki, go after this guy. Okay, so now that's taken care of him. Could calm down a bit more. And I guess since that guy's coming after us now, I guess we'll see if um, just defeating the boss this time around will actually stop the Risen from popping up. Maybe it just stops the new ones from popping up. Maybe that's it. Uh... Oh, he actually, actually, he could take him down with, uh, we'll go with the Waltz bow. Why not? Okay, thank you. Just because we never get to see archers in the stinking LP, so might as well have given you something new to look at. Uh, Lucina, go after this guy. Thank you. And Robin going to be tipping them scales. Okay, another level up for her. He's just going by so great, except for Frederick dying. But other than that, we're good. Rightful King. That sounds cool. And hey, she got uh, maxed out skills now, so she can't learn any new skills. Thank you for dodging. What does Rightful King do? Grom doesn't even have that. Uh, boy, they're just all gaining up on the new guys, thinking that they'll be easy pickings. But think again. Uh, want to see what Lucina's new ability was. Rifle King increases the trigger rate of the unit's skills by 10%. So it just makes all the other skills more likely to get pulled off. That is amazing. Uh, let's go with Tharja. Just co- just co- just so we could get you maxed out real quick. He said, prepare yourself. He's like, Ike. We like Ike. We like Ike. You deserved worse. And there you go. Tharja is fully maxed out on stats. No one is safe. Uh, let's... Oh, Tiki could get maxed out. Hmm, maybe, possibly. That would also be really cool. We're just maxing out everything. It's like, it's the end of the game. I'm getting so emotional. Everyone's coming to their full potential. There you go, Tiki's maxed out before Noe. That's kind of funny. Oh my god, so many H, so many stats. Uh, who else do we have on the battlefield? We have that guy. That's it. I guess I'll head back a bit just because um, Krom and Lissa would be more beneficial for them. Uh, heal Cherish, I guess, so we could just get some sort of little buff. Just a little bit of buff. Or not, apparently. Okay. Um, Lucina's fine to just keep dodging that dude. Uh, 11%. Yeah, we're fine. That's good. Predictable indeed. Uh, no more guys getting summoned. Okay, so this is the last of them. Switch to okay. Good to know. Uh, Lissa cannot take him out, though. Uh, Luce- Wow! I almost want to give you this kill just because you never kill anything. If Lissa can't take it out, it's all yours, Sumia, just because I feel like you deserve it. Uh, come on, Krami, you gotta step in? Of course not. Yes, they still get the heart increase either way. Switch to Sumia, it's all yours, buddy.
There you go. We all get our victories at one point or another. And finally, the only one left is the big boy. Let's take him out. Or not. Hmm. She only has the rapier? I thought I gave her the other one, the noble rapier. Guess not. Whoopsie. Right. We've made it. The altar. Wait here. I'll be back. Be careful, Krom. We must believe in him, Aunt Alyssa. Hear me, Naga. I bear proof of our sacred covenant. In the name of the exalted blood, I ask for the divine dragon's power. Baptize me in fire, that I may become your true son. Father! I'm... I'm alright! Be welcome, Awakener. Your heart has been tested and deemed worthy. Cleansed in my fire, your desire has proven to burn the stronger. <clears throat> then you will grant me the power to defeat Grima? The power of a god? Yes. But know this, I am no god. Huh? But milady, you are the divine dragon. Indeed. So do sons of men name me. But I am no creator. I possess not the powers of making or unmaking. And neither does Grima. Neither of us bears the power to destroy the other utterly. Still. Then what power can you grant me? Heed me. With my blessing, thou may draw forth Falchion's true might. The blade of the exalts shall again strike like the dragon's fane. Your strength will then be my equal. But not strong enough to destroy Grima? Yes. Alas, Grima cannot be slain. Sleep alone can be your victory. Just as your ancestor put the fell dragon to sleep a millennium ago. But you must weaken him first. Only as a final blow can my power be used to bind his. Isn't there any way to destroy him for good? There is, perchance, a power that could end Grima. However, it would be his own. I see. He has to kill himself? Yes. And never would he do so of his own volition. He seeks only to add to his power and set ruin upon the world. Now come, there is little time. Listen. Where is Grima now? Heed me. 
to the west lies a volcano known as Origin Peak. You shall find the fell dragon there. We got the exalted falchion. Our preparations are complete. Now it's time to seek out the fell dragon Grima. Next time on Fire Emblem Awakening, we'll be taking the charge to the ultimate battle. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.